Hey, what's up YouTube? Custom PC Review here, and today I'm going to be doing a unboxing of this i5 2500K for the LGA 1155 socket. And uh, for those who don't know, the uh, i5 2500K is pretty much uh, part of uh, Intel's new Sandy Bridge line of CPUs, and the K designator means that it is unlocked, so you can overclock it. So here's our, you know, this is like pretty much a uh, couple of the specs. Everyone, pretty much, you've probably heard about this already, you know, 3.3 gigahertz, 6 megabytes cache, and everything. If you really don't know the specs, um, you know, go online. Plenty of review sites are going to tell you exactly what you need to know. And uh, if you have gone out to read these review sites, you will know that this is an awesome CPU. And, uh, you know, it's got everything, I mean, you know, f uh, four cores, uh, Intel HD 3000 graphics, and uh, integrated memory controller. I'm actually going to use this CPU for an office machine. I think it's going to be great, um, you know, because it's got the HD graphics 3000. It's going to be fast. It's going to last you, you know, many, many years. And best of all, it actually isn't that expensive. So I just broke the factory seal. And we are going to take a look at the CPU itself. So inside the box we have the stock CPU cooler which I don't really like and I, I'm probably not going to use um, but you guys can take a look at it. Um, I know I uploaded previously that video of the Zygmatech Dark Knight. Um, that one's a good choice for a you know cheapo cooler that will do the job just fine or another uh, cheapo cooler that will do the job job just fine is the hyper 212 by cooler master uh, both are excellent excellent cheap coolers um, that will you know, cool your cpu just fine so uh here's the CPU itself. Um, don't know if you can see it right here, but uh, you know, nothing too special, nothing you haven't seen before. Um, it does use the 1155 socket and uh, pretty much just looks like that. Um, kind of take it out real quick just to show you, although you've probably seen videos of it before, so. Probably not. I'm just gonna wait until uh, I can stick this into a motherboard, and I'll be good to go. Uh, another thing we have in the box is the Intel Core i5 processor, uh, kind of user's manual. It's probably something that you'll never read, so I'm not gonna read it either. And uh, here it is: the unboxing of the Core i5 2500K processor.